I wrote this book to address a crisis in education. Many of us, no matter when we graduated from high school, were only educated to memorize and recite information. Perhaps a truly skilled teacher taught us critical thinking skills. But it is highly unlikely that we learn to develop the practical and creative tools that reliance on the conscience can provide. As a result, we are ignorant of our own innate, brilliant human capacity to make the wise and kind decision in every circumstance. The conscience gives us the confidence to know what's to be done and what's not to be done, no matter what challenge we face. But our ignorance of the power of the conscience blinds us and leads to suffering. The relentless onslaught of information from our mobile devices, cable news, emails, and social media feeds adds yet another layer of stress and anxiety we are not equipped to manage. At an alarming rate, bits of new data challenge our security and titillate our pleasure centers in our brain, driving us to make snap decisions that lead to fear, anger, disease, and even death. Technology may have changed how we were taught and how we stay connected to one another, but it has not addressed this serious deficit in our collective education. At this auspicious moment, an openness to embracing new and old ideas from beyond our present cultural matrix can bring us the sustenance and growth we desperately need and desire. Our modern American culture now faces a golden opportunity to go beyond its impoverished rigidity, superstition, blind customs, and dogma to attain the spiritual and philosophical wealth necessary to solve all of life's challenges. Today, a new reliance on our conscience as our guide can make it possible for each of us to access and integrate intuitive wisdom and to establish greater personal security, creativity, and peace of mind. As we experiment with the profound gifts of the conscience to determine our thoughts, words, and deeds, we are destined to become both prophets and beneficiaries of our own superconscious wisdom. For this noble endeavor, learning how to use the infinite resources of the conscience is not simply a good idea. It is a dire necessity. <laughs>